Hey, what's going on guys? So today I'm going to show you how to download Dartified UI for Fallout New Vegas. All right, so the first thing you want to do is you want to search up Dartified UI for Fallout New Vegas. Now I'm going to link Dartified UI for Fallout New Vegas in the description of this video. So this is going to be the page. I'm going to copy this just so I remember. All right, so once you click this download button right here, it will be in your download folder. I'm sure if you guys are downloading mods, you probably know how to do this stuff already. So just, it'll probably be in this folder right here or wherever you put it. Now then, once you get the file from, uh... all right, so once you get the file, you're going to go and click this button right here. This button allows you to choose files that cannot be downloaded by the mod manager. So you would want to find a file from depending on where you put it so I always download files to desktop I'm not sure if that's really normal you, you probably will find it in your downloads and then you would click on it and then you'll under this downloads tab here you will find all of the mods that you have downloaded now I always like to hide installed files in this thing here which will just not show the downloaded file because you can always just navigate th this area here to see all your downloaded files these are all my mods that I have downloaded once you download that file you're going to notice if you launch New Vegas right now that the fonts bad it's like all weird looking and it's not it doesn't look good so that is where this mod comes in now I'm going to copy and make sure I put this in the description and basically what this mod does is it, it fixes that because with the old mod, you had to copy and paste some stuff in the any files. With this mod, you don't have to touch the any files. Just click on it and download it to mod manager. Now, I apologize for my computer is slow. So basically, you just do this manual install, and then you go and do that same thing I told you to do before. And now, I have some mods that you might be interested in, such as. Uh, there's a d Darnified add-on add-on so if you just type in darn you get some add-ons you get some, like trade You're going to probably need this trait menu Darnified version because if you load up a new game Actually the trait menu will be all messed up. So I think this is kind of required So I'll also put link that in the description But yeah, basically just go around and just type in darn on here. You can find some uh like alternate fonts and stuff like if you don't like uh, the font originally you can just like see some alternate ones but yeah that's darnified UI in a nutshell now I'm going to show you guys a quick preview of darnified UI so I'll be right back in a second alright so the first thing you're gonna notice whenever you're loading in here is that is that the text on the main screen is gonna be way cleaner like neater so as you can see on the top of the screen it's a lot neater it doesn't take that much space up in the loading menu as you can see if I talk can I talk to you as you can see the I have a lot the text is a lot smaller You'll see it best in the Pip-Boy. If I get to, as you can see, there's no scroll wheel. 